Hey everybody, it's Ashley Samantha if you don't know me and for those of you returning, hello guys again. Um, but I just wanted to film a simple everyday routine that I usually do. Um, some of the products are new, some of the products are old, but whatever products are new, is they're just replacing other products that I've used. So this is what I really do every day. Um, usually it takes me five minutes, I'm not usually... Um, doing much it looks like a lot of things but it's really not much compared to a lot of people's everyday looks but um i just wanted to show you guys what i do and what you could do too and what products you could use especially if you have more dry skin um because i have dry skin um i also have eczema if you can relate um i just wanted to show you guys this really really cute look and i hope that you guys enjoy this video Okay, so first things first, I like to put a little Blistex medicated lip balm on me. And the reason why I put the medicated one on me is simply because I bite my lips a lot. And it's just a habit that I've always had since I was younger. And so I put the medicated um, lip balm on so that way it doesn't like change color. It could heal whatever cuts I may have on my lip from biting. And it's not like it's a nervous habit or anything. It's just something that I do. And I even do it in my sleep, so, you know, I try not to, but whatever. So now I'm going to take the Farsali um, Unicorn Essence, and if you guys have any, um, any favorite, um, what is this, primers, um, that you would like me to use, or that you want me to know about, please let me know, because I'm definitely open. I want to use the Tatcha, um, that's how you pronounce it. I want to use a Tatcha one, so I'm probably going to get that probably in a few weeks or something. I don't know. Because this is nowhere close to being done. This lasts pretty, pretty long. Okay. So I just simply put that on. And because I just got my eyebrows microbladed, I won't be doing anything to my eyebrows. And since this is my foundation routine or everyday routine, routine um my eyebrows won't be a part of it because it's an everyday look i don't have to like make them look more dramatic than they are natural because they are microbladed now so i'm going to use the mark jacobs um shameless foundation i'm the color deep y 500 the y is there because i simply have a yellow undertone and then if you have a red undertone, then it will say R500 or R whatever your color is. And I put it on my brush before I put it on my face, but I realized that it was just way too much. So I just do like a little circle like this, like a little ringworm on my brush. And then I put it in the places that I'm going to brush it in. And you know that if I am looking right here, it's because I'm looking at the mirror. So I simply just go over like this with the Shameless Foundation. I mean, you can build it up, but I don't see the need for me to build it up because I don't really have any scarring or discoloration or anything on my skin. Now I'm going to use the Radiate Creamy Concealer by NARS in the color So Crazy Orange. It's a new um, concealer color. I'm just gonna put it under my eyes like this. Now you can see that I put it on my nose and my chin, like what, what whatever was left over. And then I'm going to take my Bobbi Brown foundation stick in the color Cool Walnut, which is 8.25, and I'm just going to contour underneath my cheekbones and underneath my mouth for a plumper look underneath there. I kind of want to get my, my lips done, like more full. God knows I'm not, but I just want to. And then now I'm going to take the same um, foundation stick and take the Sephora concealer brush and just do this. 
My nose is already pretty small so I don't contour much. I just contour along the side because my concealer gets on the side and it's kind of like uh, cleaning it up to be honest. And then I'm going to take my Laura Mercier um, translucent powder and my Sephora um, 55 brush. I cannot pronounce that. I'm not going to even try. And I just tap it and then do that. And then I'm going to take my Makeup Forever um, powder. I think this is like a color deep or something. I'm going to have to put it down below um, because I am not sure. And I take this um, Real Technique Sculpting Brush. Now I'm going to take the Anastasia Beverly Hills Soft Glam Palette and I'm going to use the color um, Burnt Orange. And I'm going to use just like a little fluffy brush like this. Okay, and I do that just to add like some color to my eye area. And now I'm going to take my NARS um, Gulu blush that I got from Sephora for being a VIP Rouge member. It's just like one of those little gifts. And my Real Techniques um, blush brush. And then I'm going to take this um, blend setting brush, I almost said blending brush, and take my Omrizi, um highlighter. Okay, now I'm just going to do some mascara. Okay, I have my mascara on. I don't really have much eyelashes, I'm not gonna lie. But whatever. Now I'm gonna take my cork um, lip liner from MAC. Like so. And then I'm gonna take a Girls Got Needs by MAC. And then I'm going to take Honey I'm Home by Dose of Colors. Oh, that's so pretty. And then spray my face with MAC Fix Plus. And this is my everyday, what I do every day, <laughs> look. <laughs> Okay guys, so that was a look. This was more of like a chill video. Um, just me just showing you what I do and how I do it. And I don't know if this video will be five minutes because I am talking and explaining. But it usually takes me five minutes like I've said in the beginning. But I really hope that you guys like this look. It's glowy. It's nice for the spring. It's nice for summer. I really use this look all year round because I live in Florida. So it's always spring and it's always summer. Except for global warming now and it's making it colder or whatever. But, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe and thumbs this video up. If you liked it, please don't thumbs it down because that's just really mean and we don't want to be mean. Your mama didn't raise you to be mean and neither did your daddy or whoever raised you. So don't be mean. <laughs> well, I hope that you guys enjoyed this. So have a great day.